divisor of a line segment. Suppose that a is equal to x1, y1, and b is equal to x2, y2. Let c divide ab internally in the ratio a to b. Then c is given by c equals b times x1 plus a times x2 divided by b plus a, comma, b times y1 plus a times y2 divided by b plus a. So this is the formula that we're going to use to work out this question. If a is equal to 3 minus 1 and b is equal to minus 9, 1, find the coordinates of the point C which divides AB in the ratio of 3 to 1. So very important that when we label our coordinates A and B, since the A came first, the A must be x1, y1 and the B must be x2, y2. So please be careful to note which point is which and the order of the ratio. So 3 to 1. 3 comes first, 1 comes second. So our formula is C equals B times X1 plus A2 divided by B plus A, comma, B times Y1 plus A times Y2 divided by B plus A. So we're going to swap the B for 1 because our ratio is 3 to 1. So we're going to have 1 multiplied by the X1, which is going to be 3. So 1 multiplied by 3. Bring down the plus, then we have the a, which is 3, because we have 3 to 1 in our ratio, multiplied by x2, which is minus 9, so we have 3 multiplied by minus 9, and that's all divided by b plus a, which is going to be 1 plus 3. Then we bring down the comma, then we have b, again, which is 1, multiplied by y1, which is minus 1, and down the plus, then we have a, which is 3, multiplied by y2, which is 1. And again, that's all divided by b plus a, which is 1 plus 3. Next, we just have to multiply. So 1 multiplied by 3 is 3, 3 multiplied by minus 9, minus 27, 1 plus 3 is 4, comma, 1 times minus 1 is minus 1, 3 times 1 is 3, and 1 plus 3 is 4. So 3 minus 27 divided by 4 is minus 6, and minus 1 plus 3 divided by 4 is a half, or 0 0.5. So the coordinates of the point C, which divides A, B in the ratio of 3 to 1, is minus 6 and a half. As an alternative to the formula, some prefer to use the idea of translations, as outlined in the previous explanation. This is especially true when given the information involves fraction rather than a ratio. So let's have a look at an example. A is equal to 1, 11, and B is equal to 5, 3. The point C belongs to AB such that AC is 3 quarters AB. Find the coordinates of C. So the first thing to do is to draw a rough diagram. Then we have to convert the given information into a ratio we can work with. So we have the line AB, so we just start drawing a line, labeling one point A and the other point B. We are told that C is a point along AB, such that from A to C, as 3 quarters of AB. So what we're going to do is separate our line into four sections. So I have roughly one, two, three, four sections. So I'm told that the point C belongs to AB such that AC is 3 quarters of AB. So starting at A and moving along one, two, three quarters, we can plot the point C. So from A to C is three quarters of A, B. So from A to C is three quarters, one, two, three. Then obviously from C to B must be one quarter. So now we can write our ratio. We have three parts to one part, three quarters to one quarter. So our ratio is three to one. 
So if AC is equal to 3 quarters AB, so A to C, then CB is going to be 1 quarter of AB, C to B. Thus, AC to CB is going to be 3 quarters to 1 quarter, which can be simplified down to 3 to 1. So it's easier to see it when you draw it out in a diagram. And C is the internal divisor of AB in the ratio of 3 to 1. So C is the internal divisor of AB in the ratio of 3 to 1. Thus, x1, y1 is equal to 1, 11. That's the point A. And x2, y2 is equal to 5, 3. That's the point B. And A and B are 3 and 1, respectively. So it has to be 3 and 1, not 1 and 3. So we're going to use our formula, which is given to us in the formula book. So C is equal to B times x1. So it's going to be 1 times 1 plus A times x2. So it's going to be 3 by 5. All that's divided by B plus A. So divided by 1 plus 3, comma, B times y1. So 1 times 11 plus A times y2. So 3 times 3. And all of that's divided by B plus A, so 1 plus 3. So we end up getting 16 over 4, comma 20 over 4, which simplifies to 4, comma 5. So the point C is 4, 5.